Whoa, epic fucking battle. Jesus, let's. Uh, I was in the potion store there, as I said, I was going to return to White Run. And these hired thugs came in and they were kicking me in Farkas's ass. So I just said to myself, what am I doing here when I can just run back to the companions? So I just literally ra ran in the front door. The three hired thugs followed me in. And there you, you see, they just got absolutely creamed out of it. So I can take all their shit to sell. Lovely. Um, steel shield, that's actually an upgrade. Take his helmet, gauntlets, boots. Mace of Borning, lovely. Can disenchant that for the extra enchanting skill. Orcish War Axe. Um, yeah. Right, where are we? Where's this quest? Fuck's sake, glitchy menus. I also got healing hands. The spell healing hands from that enchanter up in the White Run Castle. So when Farkas goes down now, I can at least try to bring him back up. That's the whole thought behind healing hands. And that's who. Where are you, Yorvisgar? Whatever the fuck your name is. Sisters of the circle. Today we welcome a new soul. To our mortal fold. Oh, this all the looks a bit special. Has challenged and has shown his valor. Who will speak for him? I stand witness to the courage of the soul before us. Would you raise your shield in his defense? I would stand at his back that the world might never overtake us. And would you raise your sword in his honor? It stands ready to meet the blood of his foes. And would you raise a mug in his name? I would lead the song of triumph as our mead hall reveled in his stories. Then the judgment of this circle is complete. His heart beats with fury and courage. That have Why can't I move? Since the days of the distant green summers. Lads. Let it beat with ours. The mountains may echo, and our enemies may tremble at the call. It shall, it shall be, so. be so. I've heard Grant. you may actually be well, stronger boy, than you look. Well, boy, you're one of Perhaps us now. We can hunt together I soon. trust you won't disappoint. Hell no, I won't disappoint. I see you've been allowed to know some... Not every companion, though. Only members... Some take to it. Well, I work living is some may prefer. It. Yes, but you don't. And speak to right, come on. You want a better Get it over with. I was the newest companion until you came along. I guess that's okay. Out with it. Looking for work, Ayala. The Jarl of White Rock. It seems that predators have taken up residence and have been at. Someone's got to head out there and take care. I knew we could count right, looks like Get it taken care of right we away. are Nobody being commissioned to undertake these place. little shitty quests. Yeah. I think we have to do like two or three of these little shitty quests, maybe. And then we get the ball rolling a bit more on the main companion's quests. But do you know what I'm going to do right now, lads? Uh, just to, to spice it up a little bit. Actually, we can kill two wards at one stone. I can do that quest on the way. I'm going to actually travel to Riften. And we're going to go to the... It's either the Winking Skeever or the Bee and Barb. I think it's the Bee and Barb, if I'm not mistaken. In Riften. And uh, get Mercurio as a follower. So let me just type into the wiki where I can pick up that fe that helmet and I might pick that up on the way. Right, so yeah, Mercurio, I was right. He is located in the BM Barb in Riften. And the helmet is located on a shrine of Talos. If we take this kind of route here, start at this clear out, Grey Winter Watch, try and clear it out depending on how we fare out there, combat and level wise. Swing is south bearing and in this little kind of nook, there's a pathway up to a shrine of Talos, I think. 
and then go east all the way to Riften. So we've completed a mission, picked up a helmet, picked up Mercurio all in the space of hopefully half an hour gameplay. So I'm going to fast travel out just as far as the stable just to take some of the edge off. Um, right, let's roll. I really hope my recording is okay. The fucking capture software was skipping a little bit there a minute ago. Usually when something happens on the capture software though, it's not a big deal. Um, you know what I'm going to do actually? This is kind of a little bit of cheating on my part now. Uh, a lovely amulet of stem there. I didn't know I had that. Um, gonna equip the shield and I'm gonna destruction mage their asses. Hold on. Ah, fuck, I equipped it on me left hand. Yeah, because these are really weak against fire, so. Oh man, that does nothing to him. That does nothing at all to him, man. Oh god, let me out. That does nothing to him. Oh my lord, that does nothing to him, man. Sweet mother of fuck. Oh, that might be, that might be another day in the garden, man. That might be something that I can't even attempt. That might be something like beyond my realms right now did you see how how little that took off him it basically didn't move his fucking health bar there so let's see what these fucking ignoramuses have for me come here you uh want to ask you something a toll road? Never heard of that. Only in Dublin we have toll roads. Um, how about you let me through and I don't kill you? Come here then. Ah, I should have parried off that heavy attack. Like that. She gave me another chance, the stupid bitch. Right, heal up, heal up, heal up. Heal up, keep her, keep her lit. And you'll be sound. Just take them one at a go, one at a time. Heal up, heal up. See, now we're starting to get into the motions of tanking. Oh, that was a swing and a miss. Now you fucking bitch. Get the fuck out of here with that shite. Heal up. Get struck back in. The bad thing about this is about three or four different lads run out at you. As soon as you start making your way up this... Up this, uh... Walkway here. They come a bit thick and fast. For master mode. Where that is. Is bastards. I think there's a chief. Up here though. We don't really want to fuck with chiefs yet. Come here you. This fella doesn't have a chance. Come here you bandit. Bandit buddy. One more, lovely. Heal up, heal up, heal up. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Oh, there's the chief. The chief is coming in. Ball swinging. To take me out. 
Right, where are you, Chief? Come on, get the Chief on our own. Oh, God, she is high level. She is high level, man. Hold on, let me have the shield out just to take a bit off her. Oh, shit, I forgot I don't have it hotkeyed. I don't have the steel shield hotkeyed. Right, weapons. Oh, man, this is a death fest. Just sprint, sprint, sprint. Ah, this might be okay, lads. Frostbite Venom. Just hitting her up with everything I have, man. This bitch is going down. And again with the Venom, or the, the poisons. Right. Um, potions. Minor healing. Don't mind if I do. Back to full health. Take a few small chunks off of there while she's blocking. One handed is flying up, man. See that? One handed is so easy to level in this game. Mages are so shafted in, in Bethesda games. It's because they want to make it playable for all the for all the nubs. So they make one handed and heavy armor and all the armor based ones easy to uh, level. So it's more noob friendly. Come on, bitch. There's another level up. Get out of the bushes. Ah, oh, lovely. Execution. Executed. Um, let me see. I'll take take them. Right, go on, good luck, see that. Two little pesky archers up here, and then we're done so with this place. Oh shit, spoke too soon. No, we're good. Sorry about that big loud door slamming lads. Hopefully the old shock mount there will kick in. Someone obviously left a big fucking window open just now. Sounds like somebody throwing a bag of potatoes off a cliff. Um, cheese is actually good for restoring your health, by the way. If there's, if there's one item I'll grab for health purposes that's food based, it'll be cheese. Big old cheesy dick. You gotta love it. Right, um anything else in here? Papa show me what you got. Gimme that. Shimon, motherfuckers. He's missing all over the shop. Come here, you. Come on. Come on, these cunts. This fella has nothing for me. Get up off the edge of that cliff, boy. Have a wash in the old stream of... Humility. One more prick left. And then we're done with this place, hey. One level up. Finally starting to come through here on the El Master difficulty. Whoever would have thunk it. Come on. Hit me with your rhythm stick. Hit me. Hit me. Strafe, strafe, strafe. Lovely, he missed. Shimon, you bitch. Steel, arrows, iron arrows. 
Yeah. All pretty standard shit. And that's us done here, lads. Traveling on now to our destination where we have to get our helmet, which is around this big fucker of a mountain. So it's a long hour road, but it's worth it. I'm actually going to quick save. And we're on the road again, hi. Where are these lads coming from? Master Vampire, oh my god man, he's gonna murder us. Oh no, I can't fuck with him man. You're on your own there, uh, guard. See you later lads. Fuck no, we can't fuck with a Master Vampire yet. I know, ironically, I'm a vampire hunter. But that's just certain death. Or is it? Hold on, no, 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 we'll give this dude a hand, right? Fuck this. Let me wait. Where are you, you big bastard? He's dueling it out with him anyway. He's not doing too bad. Crack him with it. As I fail epically. Oh no 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 you don't. Oh no you don't. Oh no you don't you sneaky bastard. Come here you, I can see you. There he is, is it? Lovely. Vampire dust. Ah, this is because of the Dawnguard DLC. And vampire boots. Give us them. That's why that that's why he came out of there. Out of seemingly out of nowhere. The cheeky bastard. Right, um just unequip the iron arrows for a sec. I absolutely love rifting. I love the rift as a as an environment. I think all of Skyrim should have looked like rifting. The, my main gripe with the rifting or with, with the rifting my main gripe with the Skyrim map was that they tried to do too much with it in, in such a small space. And it is comparatively small when you look at uh, Oblivion and when you look at Fallout 3. It doesn't feel vast and it doesn't feel vast because they tried to do too much. That's just my, my uh, 10 cents on it. Now I know... We should be coming up somewhere soon to this dude's shack. I know for a fact because we come across that, see that shield on the hood. I think it might be an Imperial outpost or something. I know we we come across that on our way to this place that we seek. Come here you bastard. up execution but yeah like they tried to do too much with it when you look at oblivion's map oblivion was mainly just woodland and forest and it gave the illusion of grandeur it gave the illusion that you could turn off the beaten track here's the shack up here you could turn off the beaten track in oblivion and literally get lost you could literally get lost for god knows how long you could walk in a straight line if you turned left or right off the beaten track in Oblivion and just keep going and not know where you're going to pop out. Oh, Frostbite Spider. Oh shit, he has loads of HP. But in this game, everything is too well signposted. And they, they, they broke up the environment over like what, six different types of landscape. You have mountains, you have uh, the kind of autumn woodlands of the rift, you have swamp lands. You have uh, Falkreath kind of look like Scottish highlands. I tried to do too much with it man. Go on, kill him. They should have done like mountains, 
flatlands, and then coast. So you have three very distinct regions, and you have three. Uh, you, then you could make very uh, unique towns out of and cities out of that out of those regions. Like how many forgettable cities are in this game? Loads of. I mean, I only really consider White Run as as the quintessential Elder Scrolls city. Um, Falkreath, Morthal, they're all so forgettable. They, 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 it almost does the game an injustice. When you come across them, it's just like, alright, is this it? This map marker is taking up space on my map and that's all, that's all they're giving me. But, um, like, imagine if you could have maybe three mountain, mountain-based cities that have kind of a mountain theme to them and the snowy theme. A bit like in the Dragonborn DLC, you had the those dudes that resided in the in the in the fucking snowy places, whatever the fuck they're called. Forget what they're called, but they're kind of the Nords of of the uh, Dragonborn DLC. Skal or something, scald people, scaldish people, scaldic, something like that. Like you could have three mountain snowy cities like that. You could have three kind of default woodland style cities like White Run, and then you could have three coastal towns that have like a fishing coastal theme to them. I just think it would have made the game feel more uh, factionalized. Like there would have been more different factions in it, and uh, would have would have had a better flow. Definitely, the map would have had better flow. If they tried to keep things at least a little bit more uniform, like they would have in uh, Oblivion, just taking these dudes for the pelt. And here is the shrine of Talos, and we're gonna come across this epic helmet. Here it is, here sitting on a plinth type thing. Grant. We'll have a look at what that looks like right now in a minute. 